Hello again and welcome to another video. I'm Lisa Taggart from the Lavinia Stamps team and today we're making this project called Stargazer. It combines some lovely new release stamps as well as some firm favourites of mine. So if you want to see how this project was done, please keep on watching. But first, let's have a look at the materials used. Firstly, Distress Stain in Blueprint Sketch and a Purple Mica Spray. I'm also using a Distress Oxide Spray in Squeezed Lemonade. I have the Mica Stain Sprays again in Snow Flurries, Empty Tomb, a Bubbling Cauldron and Hocus Pocus. I've also got a Pan Pastel in Titanium White and wouldn't be the same without Nocturne in the Versifying Claire and Fantasia. I've also got Watermark uh, for some heat embossing and also some pastel pencils. We've got a green, a blue, my black Stabilo All and also a chalk pastel in like a turquoise colour. With gel pens in yellow, purple and white. I have a stardust pen in blue and a couple of glitters in silver and purple. We've got some embossing uh, powder in snowflake tinsel and also vintage shimmer in the glitter from Lavinia. Uh, with a glue pen and also some applicators to uh, help with the pastels. We've got an anti-static pad and of course our putty eraser and our um, battery operated eraser. Finally we've got some acetate circle ma masks and we're going to use the large any and outie. Now the stamps. We've got North Star, uh, part of the Wreath Flourish set and Taya and they are the new ones. We've got Bandit, The Swirl and Elm and Birch as well as the lovely sentiment at the end there, Fairy Spells. A nice combination I hope you agree. But first let's have a look at the inky background. We're starting off as usual with Multifarious Card and I'm spritzing that with water and I'll be going on then to spray my sprays on top of that to make our ink sandwich. If you have uh, seen some of my other videos, you might have caught the video called By the Light of the Moon, which was a recent Halloween make. Um, it also used this combination and what I'm doing here is showing you um, how I used uh, the other half of the print. So the first one was used for By the Light of the Moon and we're going to see today how to use the other half in this project.
Well, that's the project complete now that the twinkle has been added. Also, you can see that I've mounted it onto black and turquoise card, and I think it looks nice that way. It's another variation on the night scene, and as I said earlier, it's the other half of the print from By the Light of the Moon. So, as always, please take very good care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. So